it's time again to make more of these up already made a few other ones already up we'll make five of them we're going to take this 75 meters cable and we're going to start pulling it um, across from the roadside show you guys so we open up space in the further distance eh, the pole is there we, will make, we already chop out the walkway so we can bring the cable across out from there and go all the way up to the, the cable Okay guys, I'm going to show you a bit of building again. Uh, There's a last bit of building on the level and then later stage it will still continue a little bit more until it reaches the roof pitch. I'm using a line to help my guideline. You can get a nice straight line. I'm also using my level to make sure my block is level then I use my square to make sure that the wall existing wall and the other block I'm building this way is in a straight 90 degree corner like example like that the other block comes out here so that's a total square Master in Relay, hey, what kind of thing? Hey,
Hi guys, I'm going to show you guys what I'm doing today. My plan is, as you guys can see in the back of me, there on top, I have to trim those. I'm going to cut five centimeters off the bars off over there. That little train track, I call it, goes all around the beam or the top of the wall, I'll call it, of the um, frame of the house and also inside of the house. I'll show you guys now in a moment. So those little um, 10 centimeters sticking out will be cut off and in certain places off the wall like you guys will see like example there and there um, that needs to extend it because on both sides I still need to build up we need to build up over there so we it goes into the blocks like I've shown you guys before every meter it must be one of those and then um, that will be box like we have done before and I'll show you guys um, starting on Monday we'll do the boxing and pour concrete in it again and finish up that uh, concrete over there like here behind me on the on my left um, over there with my fingers but that I have to go all around there and then the same thing like that I have to sit in the middle of my wall while I can show you guys um, it's already made up. It's going to go in the center of the wall over here where that est is up there. There must be one of those pieces going right on top, 1.4 meters high, and it must be boxed after we build. We'll look like that again, and this just strengthen the whole frame. And then on the side of the house, wherever I made a little line, like example, where there's a wall when we do the extension, like there. Let me get it there. There have to be two pieces of rods coming out. Um, there's certain points of the building all along. And then that will also join up with the build on. Continue with your line to the wall you build. And then every second or third block, uh, we put a number four bar drilling into the concrete of it and strengthen the whole frame together and make it as strong as possible. So I'm going to show you guys um, a little bit um, what how far we're at the moment. Like you guys can see that's all done. That's how it looks at the moment. See how nice that is. That's all must be box of concrete. That's where doorway, inside doorway, and a little arch coming over here. That all strengthens the frame. It'll have to be there. The same over here. So there's a bit of trimming to do. Preparing and getting it ready. It's quite a lot of work to do still. Along this wall and outside, you guys can see. And then also, there's a boss coming out over here on top. I can see that red line over there coming that way. So there is quite a bit of quite a bit of work to do and cutting a little bit and bending bars. Um, like this ball example over here right to the end see if I can get it right there and anti bend on the end that all have to be coming up where his blocks going to be bolted over that side still on that long wall and also the outside wall on that side so you guys will see all along in the inside the train track. That side I still have to put on over there. It's made already. Just need to tie it up. And the same over here. That's all done. Like you guys can see. That's all done. So that's good. So most of this inside completely so there are two more pieces to go up and then just bars need to put up and then we're really good for boxing and a bit of cut of concrete wherever the lights goes put my pvc pipe already inside inside the wall or cut when i get to that point i'll see what i'm going to do and then this is going to do i'll show you guys okay so i'm ready i'm going to cut um on certain point i'm going to cut uh at all past five centimeters and the ones are going like that some places just gonna cut it short 
because you need to do the extension for the bars to go through the blocks right to the top. You guys can see um, I trim them and then we'll do the extensions as as we go later but I want to finish it's quite a lot of them to cut still so I'll go all around the whole frame of the house and the inside and get it all ready and cut um, and then I'll measure my heights and then I will take my bars and then bend them and get them all ready and put them up concentrate when you're cutting bars because the blade when you cut it it moves easy so you have to cut the bar with your blade so your blade sits in the right place if your blade is too much over it just comes back to you so that's why I always use a steady hand actually I mean to put on gloves that saved me once not to cut my hand and cut into the glove so um, it's important to have that on and glasses because uh, metal moves it quickly to damage your eyes and that's a fact. So you have to have a very steady and always be above of your, of your angle grinder and also keep it in a straight level. Don't cut like this and cut out of the groove. So you always have to cut in a straight line, the same line you cut before. Keep your blade steady, don't move your machine as you cut, so it's important to cut it straight and away from you, not towards you, always cut away from you, like when you work up a knife, you always cut away from you, never to you, same thing with angle grinder, cut away from you, the danger must always move away from you, that's a little tip, so you guys can see, I have those bars up like that, I just cut off because that's all extension. We're going to extend the bars that goes to the roof because there's still a bit of blocks to be built up. So, yeah, I'll be moving to that side now. So another little safety tip is to make sure that your, your ladder is not too much of an angle. Um, Don't put your, your leather and angle like, like this. Put it about half a meter. Give it about, give it about a half a meter away from, from your actual wall. Don't lean it too much away from the wall because if it doesn't got rubber legs in the bottom, it's going to slip out and you're going to get yourself badly hurt, injured. So give it your ladder a nice little angle coming up and make sure that it's nice and steady on top of whatever you put it. If it's against a tree, sometimes you just take a rope and tie it up in the top to stay, it doesn't slip off. Always watch the angle of it, use common sense. Think for yourself that um, you have to have it in a safe spot where your ladder stands nice and steady. guys I'm going to show you how to put on the line of train track it's already been made up um, you use the wire you use the flies it must be five centimeters uh, on the bottom of it and five on top because you have to have the concrete complete the 30 centimeters on both sides like that. Okay, 
You guys, I decided um, to sand down these four metal poles in the front of the house on the patio all along to there. Guys, I'm done with my sanding down my um, four metal poles in the front. Don't catch a fret. It's not paint. It's only metal dust and sweat. Would make me look so pretty. Okay guys, I was going to show you what I did today. I just cut this off, like I said. You guys can see there on top, all around the whole building. I've done it, and that's where the block will get another two blocks on top of there. I'll put another one over here to join those blocks over there, and so on to that. And and the inside you'll also see there there's a bar I need to go up there to go to the roof pitch up to the roof so on like there all of those ones that will go all up